What's up my Shuggies? Ashley here and in today's video I am going to do a nice little TJ Maxx home goods Target haul. I recently went shopping and found some wonderful things. You know the new trend with TJ Maxx and Marshalls as far as their makeup and of course Target and home goods for everything else. So if you are interested in seeing this video then just keep watching. Okay, the first two things I am going to talk about are from Target. That is something that I got on a whim, not thinking that it would work out, but thankfully it did and I absolutely am obsessed. And I'm gonna go back online and if they have any other colors or patterns, I'm getting them. And they are these random rain boots. I love the fact that they remind me of jellies. If anyone was born in the late 80s like me, I was absolutely obsessed with them. I had every color, every pattern. They were just my most favorite shoe and these totally remind me of them. The reason that I love them is because I recently had a pair that you know, I was wearing during the hurricane that we had here in Florida and they broke like the entire side because it wasn't, they were like two separate pieces. It just kind of like separated and I had to throw them out. And rain boots are extremely expensive in case anyone's not aware, I wasn't aware. So I didn't really want to spend $150 on rain boots. So I went online, Target, and these, because they are girls, were only $24. Yeah, that's right, $24 for rain boots. And I did some research online about the sizing because I wasn't sure having an eight and a half foot if it would work or not, but thankfully it did. I got a size six. So if you were an eight and a half to a nine, then I would say a six would work for you because they're a little bit big on me. But like I said, 24 bucks, you cannot beat them. And if you're a mom and you have a little one, they have the little baby ones too that have like the little pull on the side so they can pull them up. So cute. So 24 bucks at Target, love these. The other thing I got from Target was of course their elf sponges if anyone knows beauty blender. These are a complete dupe for them. I love them, I use them all the time. They come in different um, like, colors and packs and trios and individuals and whatever but I think these three together as a trio was like 12 bucks you can get one beauty blender for 20 so again a no-brainer moving on to my favorite department which is the makeup department at Marshall's I was there for what seemed like an eternity and I found some really good stuff so as you know, Marshalls and TJ Maxx now carry, and I think Nordstrom Rack is getting on the bandwagon too, the higher end makeup found at Sephora and Ulta and all of these different stores for a better price. But within that, they also have this little clearance section. And I happen to find this Japanese large powder brush for $5.50. That's like basically getting it for free. If anyone knows how expensive these are, I remember when these were at Ulta and they were like, I think 20 something, maybe, maybe $30. They were super expensive. So the fact that you can get that on clearance, don't forget to check the clearance section. Also in the clearance section, I got a Chi Helmet Head Hairspray. This is great hairspray, by the way, six bucks. Like, you can't beat that. And in the regular section, I just, oh, actually, just kidding, there's one more clearance item. Detox Dry Shampoo Foam. My friend, John Ye, got me onto this, and it's like a, like a mousse, it's weird, it feels like not natural and uncomfortable, but you put it in your hair dry, like mousse, but then it, it's like dry shampoo. It somehow it dries miraculously and it works and I got this on clearance for four bucks and it's not a full size but this will last me a little while I don't use dry shampoo often was that Alexa <clears throat> I don't use dry shampoo often um, but when I do it's nice to have that so for four bucks you can't beat it the other items I got were not on clearance but they were fairly inexpensive 
One of them is the Anastasia um, bronzer, and then got it in the color Rich Amber for 10 bucks, which you can't beat. This I was really on the hunt for, and I'm actually surprised that I found it, but I got two of them. And this is the Ole Henriksen, the Clean Truth Foaming Cleanser. And I have one in the shower now that I'm using, and this is my second one, because they only had two, so I bought all they had. It's six bucks, and it literally smells like you just cut an orange and put it all over your face. It's the most refreshing smell ever and I swear when I, I use two pumps on my Clarisonic in the shower, it makes your skin so soft and it makes it feel clean without feeling like stripped and dry, if that makes sense. I, I love it. I actually have several of the Ole Henriksen um, facial products and I think that they're a great line. And the last thing that I got that I actually just probably spent way too much money on at Target, but I didn't realize that they sold this brand, is the SGX NYC, and this is um, mousse that I found there for $4. Not even on clearance, just regular price, four bucks. So this is a brand, I don't know where else they sell this at, but they do sell it at um, Target, and that's where I got it. So moving on to last, but certainly not least, and that's Home Goods. Okay, so the first sign, Black Velvet Reindeer, a Nutcracker with Leopard! <laughs> Isn't he so cute? So I think this is on a little trio on the credenza when you first walk in, just for a little bit of holiday decor, and then later on I'll add my stuff that I have from last year. All right, you guys, that completes my haul from Target, Home Goods, and Marshalls. I hope you guys enjoyed all of my finds. Don't forget to go to your local stores and get yours too. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.